I have another little memory. You might have to re rearrange these memories. I have another little memory of the. Uh, I can remember the beginning of the school meal service. We were sent a note round to school to round to go home, you know, from school, saying that the school meal service was going to begin, and the children from the abbey would have to go to the Catholic school, St Mary's. Now St Mary's is it was it's demolished now, but it was on the corner. Uh, at the traffic lights where the town hall, which used to be a chapel, yeah. is on one side and St Mary's was on the diagonally opposite side oh, okay. to the town hall. And it was a very forbidding sort of building. And um, uh, we had to go in crocodile from our school to St Mary's. Mm -hmm. The meals weren't cooked at St Mary's, the meals were cooked at the council school which was on Flaxley Road. And the um, there were transported in containers, you know, insulated containers, mm. and uh, they varied a lot. I mean, uh, spam fritters we liked, bean stew we didn't because it smelt rather revolting. Uh, but anyway, we, we were all supposed to have school dinners, and the school dinner cost uh, five pence a day, yeah. uh, which is five fives of 25 pence, which is two and a penny a week, two shillings and a penny oh, yeah. a week. Mm. And... Um, uh, I met a, a girl on the bus who went to our school and in fact she was a distant relation of mine and uh, her name was Agnes and Agnes told me that um, if we um, skipped out of the crocodile we could go to the British restaurant and get our dinner for four pence <laughs> instead of oh, five wow. pence. So I'm afraid one or two of us did that. In fact, I've just been speaking to my sister in Australia this morning. And she told me she went with Agnes to the uh, British restaurant yes, once as well. Good. And you got a jolly good dinner there. The oxtail soup, I remember, was on the menu. And these British restaurants were usually, um, they were usually prefab buildings and they were all over the country. Mm. Uh, because in the days of the rationing, uh, it was, it was, you know, most of the cafes were closed and so on, and uh, it was to provide the workers with um, a, a midday meal mm. and a re at a reasonable cost. So it would probably be only uh, oxtail soup and bread or something like that, but uh, uh, at least it, we preferred it to the uh, school dinners, yeah, yeah. which were a penny more. So you see then, at the end of the week, we had five pence, which we could <laughs> go and buy sweet as well. <laughs> and, yeah. Um, 